Thank you for tuning in again today and welcome to a verse a day. God bless you. Let's head right on to prayers. Everlasting Father, King of glory, the one who was, who is, and who is to come, our soon coming King, we magnify your holy name. We thank you for Tuesday, Lord. We redeem Tuesday by the blood of Jesus. We thank you because every benefit of this day will, will come to our direction in the name of Jesus. Father, as we look into your word, speak to our hearts and give us understanding in the name of Jesus. Thank you for hearing us. Thank you for answering us in Jesus' name. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. Make his face shine upon you. Be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace amen that's my prayer for you and i that god will turn his face towards us that god will bless us even in this month where we receive the harvest of the year where we receive the fullness of the year okay the bible says that he crowns a year with his blessing so we are receiving the fullness of it a verse for today is from matthew chapter 5 verse 5 it says blessed are the meek for they shall inherit the earth meekness is about being gentle having having a, a gentle uh your 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 calm your submissive your quiet you can be easily entreated it says blessed are the meek blessed are those that are humble that are lowly in their own eyes they are not people that are, are haughty that feel like okay i'm too much i know so much the bible says that what blessed are the meek for they shall inherit the earth and if you look where the bible says that what he opposed the proud and give grace to the humble there's something about just being humble and gentle and calm that that opens doors for you especially on the earth it says when we're talking about blessings right this moment we're talking about blessings like we're talking about spiritual prosperity the way you receive from god is true when you are meek the bible says that the meek will he show his ways god reveals his ways to people that are meek that are humble and the bible makes us to understand that moses was one of the meekest he was the meekest man on earth then okay and moses talked face to face with god face to face with god so it pays it's a blessing when we are meek god will give us the the, the riches of the earth he will give us the riches of the earth i love the way the message puts it the message says you are blessed when you are content with just who you are, no more, no less. You are content. You are like, God, I appreciate this, everything you have given me. And I'm ready to be everything you want me to be. You are just content. You are not trying to compare with people or fight with people or, or show yourself more than you should show. And it says that the moment that you find yourself, at this moment, when, you've just, when you are meek, it says you've become proud owners of everything that can be bought. Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Blessed are the meek, for they will. They, the NIV says they will. It's not like they shall. They say they will inherit this earth. NLT say God blesses those who are gentle and lowly, for the whole earth belongs to them. It pays to be meek. So today for you to enjoy the blessings, be meek, okay? Be meek. Pray and receive grace to be meek. God bless you. That's our verse for today. Go ahead, like, share, and why not subscribe? God bless you.